Gun advocates say firearms can be safe when used properly, even in the hands of children. They say the key is training. Tonight, Eyewitness News New Jersey reporter Cleve Bryan talks to a young girl from South Jersey who believes in the cause so strongly she's testified before lawmakers. I lock it back and I look down the barrel if it's safe. I put the barrel back and I holster it. At just nine years old, Cheyenne Roberts has already made a big name in the world of firearms. Last year, she placed second in a statewide shooting competition, and several months ago, she testified before New Jersey lawmakers, opposing a gun control bill to reduce the size of magazine clips. Not only does she shoot and advocate, she also instructs. Always know your target and beyond. Always, always treat a gun like it's loaded. Always keep, always keep your finger off the trigger and never point it at anyone. Today, Cheyenne and her father had a tough conversation after another nine-year-old girl from New Jersey made national headlines. She accidentally shot a firearms instructor while trying to operate an Uzi submachine gun at a range in Arizona. It, it's a tragedy, it really is, but it's not in any way, in my opinion, an indictment on uh, firearms in general, on children with firearms. Dan Roberts says he's been teaching firearm skills for more than a decade. He noticed several problems in the Arizona video. Had he been in the proper position to be safe himself but still be in control of her, we probably wouldn't be having this conversation. Cheyenne has never shot a machine gun, but Robert says in the right setting, he'd let his daughter try it. She says the video makes her sad, but it doesn't scare her or change her goals. I'd, rather, I'd, I'd like to get a national title and um, be, an, be an example to kids. Cheyenne turns 10 on Thursday, and when I asked her what does she want for her birthday, she says to get her New Jersey hunting license. In Franklinville, I'm Cleve Bryan, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. This is a hot topic, and we'd love to know what you have.